As soon as I started living with people that were not my parents, I enacted something that I called the safe word. I've used it now with my husband. We use it in our relationship. We use it as pe two people who live together. So my first night moving into college, I had a roommate and then a sweet mate. And that first night we sat on my dorm room floor over a bag of like tortilla chips or something. Let's create a word that if we have to like talk to the, in, like one of the other people about something in the room, something that requires us to like live in harmony together, you say that word first and it kind of lets the person like prepare their emotions that you're about to get feedback about something about you, about this living situation, but don't get upset about it because this is so that we can stay friends and live peacefully. Now our safe word was snowman and this is how this worked. So one of my roommates name was Emily. Emily would be like, hey, snowman, Sarah, if you leave the shower curtain open one more time, I'm going to slit your throat. Funnily enough, I'm the one who created the rule and I'm the one who got snowmaned the most.